name is Serena and in this episode of Tea Around the World we're going to have a look at a London Fog. Even though you might think that this drink is from the UK, it actually originated in Canada. And even though you might think that this is a very very fancy drink, it actually only consists of three ingredients. So a very important is to have an Earl Grey, then we need milk and a little bit of vanilla. And we're going to make frothed milk, which is why it is called a London Fog. <laughs> so clever. So this recipe will be enough for one mug or two cups. And all we need is one teaspoon of a good old Earl Grey. Put it into something like a tea strainer. You can, you can brew the tea with the method you prefer. I just like to use my teapot. And then we will need one cup of water, so 250 millilitres. And we are going to let this tea steep for about five minutes because we want to create a rather strong tea. While our tea is steeping, we can already prepare the broth milk. And all we need is a French press or any device you have to make broth milk. You can even use a jar and shake it until it's doubled in size. So I'll use a French press and I'll just pour in half a cup of milk. And it's best if this milk is hot or at least warm and you can just heat it up in the microwave and it's also good if you don't make a mess like me but if it's like um, I feel like I can't do a video without making a mess so it's fine <laughs> and then we aim for this milk or the froth milk to have doubled in size <laughs> so now we are ready to mix everything together and make our London fog so one of the last things we will need to do is add our vanilla to our tea, just like half a teaspoon. I do really like to use vanilla extract for this one, um, just because I, do, I think it has the most intense flavours <laughs> and then you can sweeten it to your taste. I like to use um, about a teaspoon of sugar and then just stir it until everything is dissolved. Now that our tea is ready, we can pour the tea into our cup or a mug or whatever you have. And then top it off with your frothed milk. So I made the second cup in a glass cup so that you can see how it looks like when you pour the frothed milk over your tea. So let's have a zip. I love it. It's so good. I think the vanilla and the bergamot of the yogurt right, do really make a difference here. <laughs> it's really good. I love it. And it does really make a difference to an Earl Grey latte. <laughs> My cup is enjoying it too. I feel like this is the perfect tea if you want to feel like a barista at home. I did really enjoy preparing this tea because it it's obviously a tea. <laughs> and it has vanilla inside, which, which is a flavour I love. So that's basically it from today's episode of Tea Around the World. I hope you will give this tea a try. Let me know in the comments which tea from around the world interests you the most so I know which one to film next. So as always, let's have a zip together. Until next time and bye!